You first want to grab one of these plastic bath mats from Dollar Tree. Go ahead and lay it down flat. And then grab one of these wired wreath frames, also came from Dollar Tree. Place that right on top of the bath mat. And then just trace out the middle section of that wreath frame onto the mat. Once you have that traced out, go ahead and just cut that right out. Next, I'm using Waverly chalk paint in the color Truffle. This is a brown chalk paint. I went ahead and just painted that bath mat using two coats. Dry the first coat before going on to the second coat. And while that second coat is still wet, I ended up going over it with a little bit of black chalk paint and just kind of blended the brown and black together and just kept mixing the black and brown until I was satisfied to how the color looked. Let that dry and then grab your wreath frame, place it face down and then place the bath mat face down on the back side and then just begin zip tying it all around the inner wires. And when you're doing this step, you wanna make sure that you have the bath mat pretty tight and then just tighten those zip ties as, as tight as they will go. And just for some extra support, if you wanna do this, just add a little bit of hot glue along the edge of the bath mat as well. Next, you wanna grab some clothespins. You want a total of 72 clothespins. Grab these from Walmart or Dollar Tree. You wanna grab a large Ziploc bag, add in the acrylic paint color of your choice. I'm using yellow. You wanna just add in some water, give it a good shake, and then add just a little bit more water and give it another good shake. And then you're good to just add in all of those clothespins all at the same time. I added all 72 in this bag and I just sprayed it with just a little bit more water and then you wanna just shake that bag right up until all of those clothespins are completely covered. And once you could tell that they are covered, you wanna just dump that right out and allow those to completely dry. And then once those were dry, you want to just begin adding the clothespins right onto the inner wires of that wreath frame. So 12 clothespins will fit into each section of that wreath frame, just an FYI. And this is what it looks like so far, super cute. I then decided to add just a little bit more of that brown chalk paint on the bottom section of those clothespins just so it kind of blends in with that middle section. Let that dry. I then made a buffalo check bow out of my Easy Bow Maker. Just use some Dollar Tree adhesive glue with a mixture of hot glue and just place that right at the top. And there you go, guys. I think this came out so adorable. I hope this inspires you to create your own in your own special way. If it did, please be sure to sprinkle the love. Thank you so, so much, and I hope y'all have a good rest of your day. Thanks. Bye.